welcome to you your sap sap sd youtube channel please subscribe channel for more videos and to get the more knowledge on sap sd today we are going to discussing about rise of r i c e f w this topic is more important for interview point of view as well as implementation project okay without rise of there is no interview as well as there is no implementation project what the rise of will form reports interface conversion announcement forms and workflow reports interface conversion announcement forms and workflow okay with the rise of there is no implementation project as well as there is no interview definitely interview will get the questions from rise of as well as in implementation role of make this order the project definitely we have to touch one of this okay reports what are the reports and an sap uh, reports okay is a executable program that is able to the read the data and the generate output based on the criteria selected by the end user okay for example if you see uh, you want the list of the customer or the t code vcust you want the list of the material mm60 you want list of the sales orders va05 and in as per va05 in um, uh, for deliveries we have 06 for invoice we have 05n okay these are standard reports to uh, to get the uh, to see the list of the orders list of the deliveries or what the sales happen what the whether we done invoice or not whether we create invoice or this this kind of information you want to see in the list okay or else client requirement not fulfilled with the standard report then we are going to build the new g reports like a g orders g sales nothing but all order information delivery invoice information has to be in one place all order delivery invoice and customer and payments everything has to be in one place okay those it standard is not possible we need to build through g reports in that case we are going to use this one reports okay so already i explained two classes regarding the report one is the class number 20 here you can able to see all the tables here you can able to see all the tables okay you can here you can able to see all the tables i think it is not there okay in class number 20 you can see uh, what are all the tables is sd but because of if you want to build any report definitely we need to aware of tables in s4 and also uh, we we have some other tables i, I will explain some other class okay we have uh, some additional tables came those i will explain uh, class number 20 can able to see the report uh, the uh, tables how to what are tables is how, how it will store this everything will be there that we need to aware as well as class number 65 reports clearly explained with the example clearly explain with the example so for example this is the sales report this is the report uh, li like this user will provide so in one report they want customer name company code city sales or division division plant material metal code this this all information they wanted one report one report so like that user will provide and go on good sample like this will provide so based on this we need to build the based on this we need to write the logic like if selection criteria is if user selection criteria is okay if user selection criteria is sales organization document or something so then the logic has to start how to start how to end for uh, all, each and every field we need to write the logic so in class number 68 clearly i explained each and everything you can go and watch that okay so in interview if there are anyone asking about the reports uh, you can you can first uh, if any tables you can explain the tables by using those tables we can build the report the report as it is you can say uh, i work in my real time so how we provide the logic means what are the logic we wrote here right that you can explain okay this already clearly explained class number 65 you can go and watch that okay next interface interface what are the purpose of interface it will help to transfer the data from one system to another system it will help to transfer the data from one system to another system so it's like idocs rfcs okay class number 69 and c105 two classes we have, uh, we discussed about the interface idocs one is that once uh, once p was created in uh, once uh, 8 800 okay how system is uh, generating the sale order in 810 once you create the material in 800 how system creating another material in 810 
ओके सिस्टम टू सिस्टम वी कॉप बिकॉज वी डोंट हैव क्लाइंट टू क्लाइंट वी डन दर वी डोंट हैव सिस्टम बट रियल टाइम द सेम कॉन्फ़िगर बाय यूजिंग सेम कॉन्फ़िगरेशन सेम प्रोसेस वी कैन ट्रांसफर द डेटा फ्रॉम वन सिस्टम टू अनदर सिस्टम ओके यू कैन वॉच दैट दोज क्लास definitely in interview they will ask about the idocs what the t code uh, for monitor the idoc to change the data in idoc to repose the uh, to repose the repose t code and uh, basic uh, types and message numbers and message types okay uh, the configuration t codes okay this everything they will uh, they will ask in interview so we need to prepare on that so clearly i will explain in idocs okay class number 16 and 105 you can go and watch that next conversions it's like it will help to upload the legacy data into sap like a uh, in implementation project in, in legacy system with any customers materials open orders open deliveries invoice anything if is there any open data if you want to upload into the sap okay then we are going to use the conversions so we can use lsmw ltms and bdc so uh, my choice is bdc always because of because of if using lsmw or uh, ltms in case uh, some some manual errors will be get in mid uh, between the, uh, middle of the process but bdc it not like that so above or what you can do you will record that uh, uh, things what whatever we needs to upload in sap and we will provide the excel by filling uh, filling the data in excel ओके अंडर विक द एरर केम वर द एरर केम वाय एरर केम एक जात वाय एरर केम एक जात लोल गेदर बाय फिल्टरिंग दैट एरर्स अंड आई मीन वी कैन सी दैट वेर विद सक्सेसफुल सक्सेसफुल फेल मी फेल्स दोस फेल आर्डर्स अगेन वी कैन अपलोड सो कंपेयर टू द दिस एल 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 टी एम एस बी डी सी द वेरी इट इज अ वेरी सिंपल ओके सो this conversation will use at a cutter activity level so we are calling as implementation project cutter activity level so we explained about the what is the cutter activity the activated methodology in asap methodologies so you can go and watch that uh, the conversations uh, you can see the lsmw already explained in class 94 how uh, we, how we can upload the orders how we can upload the customers okay this already explained in uh, class 94 you can go and watch that this is the conversions okay next enhancements next announcements any anything any business scenario if it is not possible in sap sap standard any announcement added the business requirement cannot be satisfied using standard then we are adding some custom functionalities by modifying the solution okay these are called as announcement any standard function is not not relevant for business scenario then we are going to use the and then we are going to use the announcement by using announcement we are doing the uh, uh kind requirement like uh, if you see the standard uh, uh, store location is not available uh, it's not get automatic order level for that we have to do the announcement and uh, uh, if you see uh, number ranges so if you see one of the class 67 number range invoice number range so based on the sales area was they need to get the number range uh, or else uh, i'm going to explain one more announcement and uh, that is uh, after this i can explain that is class number 18 still i am not explain i will explain later it's like a recent one of the announcement once order is created once order is created we are giving order confirmation output to the user but your the client requirement is here if it there if in order level there any delivery block create block or incompletion log or any um, billing block something okay then output shouldn't be triggered if there is no block then only it has to trigger it is only for particular sales organization particular sales organization so this not possible in standard then we have to do the announcement like that any requirement pricing point of view or output whatever is that whatever the process scenario is not possible in standard then by using announcement we can achieve that so already class number 16 7 i explained about the number range announcement you can watch that and uh, class uh, next uh, after this i'm going to explain on new tables later i'm going to explain the this is uh, announcement you can see that okay so definitely interview point of you need to know the reports interface conversion and so this all are uh, important interview point of as well as implementation project so cl- clearly each and every topic clearly explained you can go and watch that okay forms so without forms there is no implementation okay because of 
that is a uh, once invoice created definitely we need to we need to give print out to the customer one order is created we need to give order confirmation customer and delivery chalan we need to give the truck driver so this all are mandatory so we need to we need to do the development we need to do the uh, development for outputs so as a uh, consultant we need to provide the logic to the developer to uh, build that uh, uh, to get the law uh, fields information to the print out okay so order level we are we are how the output delivery level we have invoice level we have quotation level we have inquiry level we have this many places we can uh, do it for uh, output okay output so uh, how the output logic we can provide to ababar i explained in uh, class number 66 and how to create the output okay how to create the as a function how to create the output types and how to assign that already we done in our output determination class so output determination class you can watch that and uh, how to provide the logic to ababar for that you can watch this class number 66 this, this will more help to you to develop the forms next workflow next workflow what the workflow it's like a workflow refers to the sequential flow sequential flow of transaction data from one level to another as per the organization hierarchy at each level action is required and once action taken the workflow will advance to the next level okay so for example um uh, uh, let, let me discuss this one also doing this objective the functional consultant coordinates with the technical team and develop the custom flow logic okay and uh, this will contain the details uh, because uh, details data um, details of the data to be sent and will provide to the condition to trigger the workflow for example in standard we have the status profile is there once order is created it has to block for delivery or the other person has to come and release that order then only delivery has to create this is a standard uh, this is a standard class uh, that we we can call as a workflow that is a class number 51 you can go and watch that but something else it's not a standard like a once order is created it should be uh, once is order is created it should be approved by manager through mail once order is created the order information has to go to the through mail it has to go to the manager he, he has to approve through mail not from sap he will approve through mail automatically the uh, it has to approve order has to approve and uh, system allow to create the delivery so this is not a standard in pos- it is not possible in standard so we have to do the announcement and uh, after billing creation the payment needs to be verified by other person in that case also we are going to do the uh, workflow uh, uh, okay approval is everything so like that we can do the announcements and uh, forms and we can develop the workflows and we can do the conversation interface and uh, reports okay this is the this is the about rise of so each and every class reports we have two classes and interface we have two classes conversation one class and announcements one class is there one class i'm going to uh, talk about later and forms we have two classes for logic and uh, development and the workflow in standard we have one class status profile the remaining is for customization in case is not possible in standard okay this is the rise of once again thank you all for watching the videos please subscribe channel for more videos and to get the more knowledge on sapsd thank you all